I always forget to unmute myself. I always do. At least I had someone in the chat this time to tell me. <laughs> I could have been doing that for like half an hour and then only just noticing. I'm going to move my uh, phone out of the way so I can actually see that my microphone's turned on. <laughs> but yeah, thank you. Uh, thank you. I'm, uh, I hope you're uh, looking forward to it. I mean, you'll, you'll, you'll enjoy the mod. So yeah, um, I basically did the first dungeon, uh, when I was streaming this on YouTube. But I didn't really get any views or any chat members on YouTube. I think Twitch is definitely more, um, how should you say it, um, streamer friendly, newbie streamer friendly. Although I have heard stuff about what they're doing with their uh, monetization, and uh, which kind of sucks, but it's fine. So, without further ado, let's uh, let's re let's pick up where we left off. The covenant that p appeared from Milady's corpse was unexpectedly absorbed into Feig. After resurrecting the caustic late Milady, the group heads to Arrow's safe house. So, when I streamed this for the first time, my uh, my computer was a bit uh, awkward with it. It was struggling. It's locked and cannot be opened. Eh? Wait, but then how do I leave? How, how do I? Oh, 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 okay. Okay, there it is. Okay, let's get out of here. Once you've discovered special waypoints known as portals, you'll be able to instantly teleport between portals within the same dungeon. They can make long dungeon treks much more efficient, so keep an eye out for them. Ah, uh, uh, my chat window is a bit small. I just decided to to fix that. Yeah, this game is visually very very nice. Yeah, pretty much. The, 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 um, I forget who the director of these sorts of games are, but yeah, he's really... He makes really stylish games. And you'll probably tell when I get into combat, the menus also have that distinctive uh, stylish look to them. Okie doke, let's go. Back to the entrance, let's go. Oh, right, that was actually to go further. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you very much, Hermit. And I hope I hope I can do a good enough job for the VOD later. Okie doke, so uh, first we have to leave. The only issue I have is the camera. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, no, 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 yab it, yab it, no, 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 leave me alone. Ah, 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 no. Ah, oh, god damn it. Here goes nothing. Oh my god, the furries again. Booting summoning program. Oh, that's a, that's, that's a really, that's a really good hashtag. <laughs> maybe, maybe that can be my, like, support. That could be my support tag. Don't lose heart. Yeah, that could work. Not over that yet. Try. Well, we already know what they're weak to. And we are way stronger than them anyway, so there really isn't anything to worry about. It's never just like... I got it's all you. You got it. You can sign to Snowfall. Too late for and this snow. should finish them off. Anyway, I hope you enjoy your shift at work. Hermit, I'll see you. I'll see you when I see you. So uh, they are no easy. Way. Yeah, it's gonna be kind of quiet now. I have a feeling that this is not gonna be one of those um, playthroughs that I can see a lot of people watching. But it it is what it is. Just gotta accept that. So uh, let's uh, let's head to the safe house. So yeah, um, 
if you're watching the VOD of this, be sure to check out my part one on YouTube. You've got my channel in the, uh, right there. So it, it's all good. Pretty basic, but still pretty stylish, isn't it? It's like, it's like one with nature almost. It's like a fusion with nature. <laughs> yeah, this place is pretty cool. I can imagine it's troublesome when it rains. With the hole in the roof and all that. <laughs> is it just me or was that a bit blurry? Hmm. Not really what I expected. But it's not bad. Yeah, this is the reason Glad you like it. A oh. big humility. Feel free to make yourselves at home too. Okay, okay, I'll turn the auto off for this. Um, so yeah, this is the main reason why I've got this game in a window. Because, you know, they've got portraits, and my portrait, my, my VTuber model would be in front of some of the portraits, and that would just look weird, so that's why I've done, that's why I'm, I'm doing it in the window. I am hoping to one day either make a more interesting overlay, or maybe commission one. But I think if I'm going to commission anything first, it's probably going to be an atelier for the uh, for the main main for my main overlay because you know I really need one. Thank you for everything, Arrow. Yes, thank you, Arrow. <laughs> wow, my lady's got a bit of sass, doesn't she? <laughs> oh no, it's Melody. It's actually Melody. It's spelled Melody, but it's Melody. Okay, let's get right into it. Arrow, you were trying to save Melody because of that light form thing, right? Ah, the life form. Oh yeah, the one that entered Feig. Guess there's no point in hiding it now, is there? Yeah, that's right. I mean, I have a feeling we'd have worked it out, you know? Considering we were born from, like, some sort of supercomputer. We're bound to be, you know, she's bound to be super intelligent. The Covenant came out of Melody, and then went into me. And that... That makes me worry that something might happen to Feig. Maybe she's gonna become an enemy. It'd be nice if that wasn't the case, but that's just the feeling I'm getting. <sighs> of course. It's because I died. Right. So, it would have to have found a new host, wouldn't it? I get that these Covenant things are important somehow, but I'm only just now starting to wrap my head around it. Can you tell me more about them? You two yes. are Devil Summoners, after all. Yes. Um, we need to learn, after all. <laughs> Alright, this is my understanding of it. Covenants are like a big source of energy, and they've been passed down from soul to soul for generations. Eh? Yeah. Well, that's interesting. Supposedly, these Covenant holders wield great power. So it makes sense that when she died, it had to find a new host. Even though she got brought back to life, it's not like the, uh, it's not like the spirit would know that. What kind of power? Well, simply put, possessing a Covenant awakens the holder's latent abilities. Eh? Yeah. In some cases, it can even spark, well... Evolution. Now, what could he mean by that? They say there's a total of five covenants out there. Having one as powerful as it is, but the effects would only go as far as the individual could take them. I'm gonna change where my uh, where my phone is, so I have a better way of looking at the chat without you know, without me looking away from the camera. Now. If someone were to possess all five, then that'd be something else entirely. They Gather control all five covenants, and you could destroy the world. You could what? Or rule it, or destroy it. I guess either would work. You could call forth what's known as the Great One, a being prophesied to bring ultimate destruction to the world as we know it. That's what they say, at least. 
And that's what the enemy wants to do. They want to destroy the world for whatever reason. Summoning this great one is Phantom's top priority. Am I right, Melody? Please. You don't really need me to confirm that, do you, Mr. Double Agent? <laughs> yeah, you probably don't. If the Holder dies, the Covenant gets passed on to someone else. As a result, there's almost always some sort of conflict surrounding them. What a surprise. So whoever's nearby when, the, when that person dies basically becomes the new host. I see now. So when Melody died, the Covenant found a new owner in Fig. And in someone as potentially powerful as Feig, that could be a problem. These covenants and this world-ending Great One you mentioned. Yes. I believe these may be the seeds that make Ion's prediction come true. I mean, it would make perfect sense, wouldn't it? Because Feig and uh, Ringo are trying to stop... The apocalypse, basically. And saving Arrow and Melody is part of that, was part of the prophecy. So, by neutralizing that, we, uh, I hope we've dealt with the, uh, the immediate threat anyway of the apocalypse. But if there's an evil organization trying to revive the Great One, then that's obviously not good news. Gotta be. Considering we're trying to stop the end of the world. The Phantom Society is shaping up to be a pretty big obstacle. So basically, we're going to have to destroy the... Uh, we got to destroy them if we want world... Well, it won't be world peace, so to speak, but at least we'll stop the apocalypse. Agreed. And now that we know their intentions, we must protect this covenant inside of me at all costs. Yes, we've got to protect Feig. That's going to be a problem for me. Wait, what are you doing, Melody? Forget it, Melody. Our summoning abilities are changed. Oh yeah, that's right. Now we own all their summons, and we're the only ones who can give them permission to use them. So you could say we've got the, uh, we've got the, uh, we got the strong hand here. We don't have control over our demons. Ringo does. We think it might be due to the soul hack. I mean, that's the only other way to explain it, right? Excuse me? No one told me about this. Well, you never asked, so... You know, it's not our fault. Don't look at me. Oh, right. Oh. Oh, that's right, yes. So we've got choices to make. Um... So... Basically, I can change how other characters perceive me, or perceive Ringo. I should I should technically say that. Yeah, it's Ringo. I'm uh, I'm just gonna take my hat off for a second. I hope you don't mind. Ah, there we go. I mean, I feel kind of odd being the only one wearing a hat in this in this place. <laughs> Should I, I'm, uh, should I let her know about this, or should I just, I, sh or should I protect Arrow here? Uh, I think it's probably best we don't tell her anything yet because she still seems kind of hostile towards Ringo. So I don't really think. Letting her access her powers is really a, a good idea right now. There's no point in blaming Arrow. He's in the same boat as you, Melody. Exactly. You can't blame someone who's suffering the same as you. Go ahead and explain it to her, Ringo. Well, it's not as if I wanted to take your powers. I'm not all that sure how it happened myself. Nope, exactly. It's all new to her because... Her and Feig were only just born right at the start of the game, so they're basically hatchlings still. I sincerely hope you don't intend to steal my freedom as a summoner. That's exactly the kind of low tactic Yatagarasu would pull. Hey, oi, 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 oi. Don't, don't go, don't assume we're like them. No, you've got it all wrong. I really was trying to help. 
I sure hope you were. Were you? Then can you prove to me that you and Little Miss High Tech here aren't in on this together? Uh... Oh my. She's very, uh, doubtful of us. That's not a good sign. Maybe I should have let her know about Ion Summoning. Oh well, too late for that now. Just gotta roll with it. Alright, that's enough. Melody, just what is the Covenant to you? I don't think I need to explain why the Phantom Society needs summoners, do I? Well, no, you don't really. Right. So you're after the end of the world too, huh? <gasps> do you think that's really what she wanted? <sighs> hmm... Hey, Ringo. Mind if I ask you something? Sure. What's up? Feek's being awfully quiet. <laughs> I guess she doesn't really have any room to interject because she just arrived on the scene. So she doesn't really know. Ion aren't human, right? So why was the Covenant passed on to Fig? Good question. What are you, really? I believe we're just digital data, right? We're like a Digimon. We agents of Ion are highly intelligent beings born from a sea of information. Honestly, hearing about this sea of information is reminding me of Fate Extra. <laughs> I guess they both, they both, both series are kind of techno technology like based, so it makes sense that they make have similarities at least. By installing an ego into a simulated human body, the foundation is laid for a soul to develop alongside it. Yeah. So a machine can have a soul? Is that so strange? Your bodies are practically machines too, albeit fleshy ones. <laughs> I mean, I guess so, but to a regular human, you you guys are just strange, you know? If, if people think, I mean, I guess in the alchemy world, a homunculus is basically like what Ringo and uh, Feig are. I mean, not, 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 not fun, I mean, fundamentally at least, not, not, you know, actually. Even for our kind, there is still a lot about the soul that remains unknown. Like where they come from, or what they truly are. We're no experts either. Exactly. I mean, I guess technically they could be born with all the information they needed. But the self-evident truth is, should one accurately recreate a human body and provide it with a means of control, then a soul will naturally take root. Eh, well, that's an interesting way of looking at it. Anything that's capable of housing a soul should would naturally draw one? Huh. In other words, it's not just this mechanical shell, or rather, this body at play. It's a complex chain of different physiological reactions that shape the soul. I mean, this, this, this game's going pretty deep into, like, philosophy and stuff. It's, uh, not really my forte. Yeah, I didn't get any of that. <laughs> you're not the only one, Arrow. You're not the only one. I'm glad we're not the only ones either. Uh. Okay, then we're supercomputers trapped inside Grandfather Fox. That's an interesting way of wording it. In even plainer terms, our origins may be different, but we are more or less the same as humans. I mean, they certainly look human. That is definitely something you can't deny. The trade-off is, in this form we can't operate at Ion's full power, nor do we have access to massive amounts of data like we used to. Yeah, because they used to, because they were all part of Ion at one point. Ah, oh, I see. I guess that's why they said this form was the most ideal for our mission. I guess because they don't know too much, so it's uh, any danger to Ion is minimalized in this sort of form. Naruhodo. Can't really soul hack if you don't have a soul yourself, can you? <laughs> I guess that's true. That's very lucky. Oh, that's right, Ringo. I meant to tell you earlier, but I've made a new discovery. Yeah. Well, let's hear it then. It's about Target Alpha, Ichiro Onda. Uh, yeah, he's the scientist. His death and Arrow's death were supposedly w the, the triggers that would cause the end of the world. And they were both dead when we found them, so that was kind of a... Uh, yeah. It's a good job we were able to revive Arrow, at least. 
but maybe Feeg revived the uh, Oda Under. Hopefully, if I remember right. That's the famous computer engineer. What about him? Fig was acting separately from me at the time. She was trying to protect Onda just as I was trying to protect you, Arrow. But they were both dead when we arrived. Dead on arrival, as you would say. The mission was a failure, but I managed to restore the surveillance camera footage. I found a video of what happened in the 24th Ward Municipal Tower. Wait a minute, does that mean Fee can't soul hack? Surely she could have revived him if she wanted to, but she didn't. So maybe she can't soul hack. And? He was killed by someone named Iron Mask. Iron Mask? Oh my god. Oh man, that reminds me of Tales of Arise. That's who the main character was called at the start of the game, because he had an Iron Mask on, so they just called him Iron Mask. I should really get back to playing that. I mean, I say that, but I was streaming as a regular streamer when I was playing that before, so... I'd probably play it again, as a VTuber. If you'd like it, to, like me to, that is. Feel free to let me know on Twitter if you want that, because, you know, my Twitter's there. Did you say Iron Mask? The leader of Project C finally makes his move. Eh? Project C? Eh? Manny? What, what's what's Project C? Huh? It was him. Well, they seem to know who he is. A uh, little information would be pretty nice right about now. So, you know him. Or, well, I guess you would, seeing as you two are together. Eh? Really? They're an item? Eh? I, I can't believe that. Well, that's a bit of a revelation. You are? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I thought exactly the same. <laughs> he called himself Iron Mask. Are you absolutely certain? Let's take a look at the footage. Output in video. Okay. I guess she works. I guess we can be projectors as well. I guess they can. I guess they they can be projectors as well. Ooh. So he was on his own. Impressive. I can't imagine how many security measures were in your way. You're no mere trespasser. Oh, okay. So that Ichiro explains it. Onda, I presume. The greatest computer engineer of our time. It's a pleasure. And you are? I am the leader of Project C. You may call me Iron Mask. Well, there's our evidence. <laughs> a bit on the nose. Was Black Suit taken? Or are you a prisoner broken free? Well, it's fine. You're welcome to celebrate with me, masked man. So is your little wallflower. Wow, he's very casual to his would-be assassin. It's complete. A system to shatter the status quo with a perfect name to shake the very foundation of Akadeet. The Omni System. Glorious, isn't it? Can't you feel its power? Too much power for but human now hands. It's finished, and I'm done with it. If you're a thief, then go ahead and take it. Wow, he's that. He doesn't care. You designed a masterpiece, Doctor. The Omni System will uplift mankind to new heights. Alas, I'm afraid your part in our grand pageant ends here. We want something quite different from you. Your death. I should have known. If you don't want my creation, then you must be after me. Well, what dwells within me? You want the Covenant? Yes, ah, of course they do. You're already aware. You do know I'm a genius. Doesn't mean you're immortal. Oh my goodness! Wow! <laughs> C. 
say, masked man. Oh my. One last tip. Call it a parting gift from a genius. Are you even gonna be able to say it before you die? No one can control the future. Iron Mask. Not even a super genius. Yep, throw yourself off the edge. Ooh. Gotta admit, the graphics are really pretty. At least I have a future. Well, I guess that's true. Oh, she actually, they actually grabbed it. Right, so now we know who we have to kill. She literally forced it into him. I didn't think you could eat them. I thought they'd just go into Goodbye, your chest like they were you. Your covenant served you well. But it will serve me far better. Wow. It's a good job we're able to recover that information. That's a very big clue. So that's it. Ichiro Ando was a Covenant holder too. Well, the Covenant, I mean, I guess it makes sense. And they got a good look at Iron Mask. Plus, whatever that freaky, murdery guy was. <laughs> murdery guy. <laughs> that's silly. The guy that tore out Ando's Covenant, you mean? Strength like that definitely isn't human. Maybe it's some new species of bear or something? A bear? Are you serious? Really? You were on Iron Mask's team. Know anything about that? I wonder. Not really. All I know is he called that thing Zenon. He also referred to it as a vessel for the Covenants. All oh, right, so they're gonna gather the Covenants and put them in that guy? I see. I think I see, anyway. A vessel for the Covenants, huh? So that must mean, because most, most people can only have one Covenant, but that person can have all of them at once. Maybe, maybe that person, maybe that guy, maybe he's going to become the one. It seems he lacked the power to fend off their attack. I mean, he is a scientist. I mean, scientists aren't necessarily known for their strength or anything. Say, humility. If you and Iron Mask are an item, why is he after you? Are you serious, Arrow? It's because she has a covenant, that's why. Or she did have a covenant, which means Feig is in danger. <laughs> Ringo, what would you say to working together? You help me meet with Iron Mask. Okay, now she's willing to negotiate. What's in it for me? I'll help you prevent this end of the world or whatever you've been going on about. And I'll give you all of the Covenant Holders' names. Deal? Well, that would certainly be helpful. And I guess it's a lot easier than trying to find them out for themselves. You sure? I thought you wanted the world to end. Well, I guess not. Some things take priority. Fair enough. She's a very business-like lady. I can respect that. All right then, Melody. It's a deal. Rather quick to trust, aren't you? All right. So I guess whenever we recruit one of the guys, one of these new, one of the new characters to our team, we'll get plus ten soul points. I guess. Not at all. But we both benefit from this. And for now, that's all I need. Yep, pretty much. Speaking of which, I'm hoping we can count you in too, Arrow. I mean, he's kind of in a bit deep at this point. Sure. It's not like I don't have stakes in this. Yep, pretty much. Alright then. It's settled. Let's all just try to get along from here on out. Well, I sure hope it goes that smoothly. But... It wouldn't be much of a game if it were if it did. <sighs> yeah, I guess you can, yeah. Hmm. Seeing as he was a double agent, I guess you can't exactly cozy up to him right away, huh? We just need all the manpower we can get. 
you know, I, I don't think that Ringo and Feig would be enough on their own, so getting extra allies is always a good thing. You just gotta hope that they can put aside their differences and get along. Not in your wildest dreams. Still, I won't drag my feet around, so you've got nothing to worry about there. That's all we needed to know. That works for me. Though if possible, I'd appreciate it if you'd stop glaring at me like that. <laughs> you may be asking a lot there. Melody definitely doesn't seem to be that type of woman. But of course. Thanks. <laughs> I bet she's still glaring even when she says that. <laughs> you guys can do whatever you want. Just as long as we work together. Yeah, pretty much. So long as, you know, you get along. That's all we need. On to the main topic. Melody, if you could go over the Covenant Holders for us. I can't wait. Right. These are the five people the Phantom Society had marked as Covenant Holders. I mean, I don't think you'd doubt their information. First is Iron Mask, leader of the Covenant Recovery Project, or Project C. He's a Covenant Holder as well. Well, I guess that makes sense. And basically save his for last, I guess. So basically, they def that guy would take his last because he's helping him get them all. The Covenant Recovery Project. How is the Phantom Society able to identify these individuals? That's a good question. A Covenant Holder can detect another simply by looking at them. A quick glance in their direction is all it takes. Oh. Well, that's convenient. Coupling that with the organization's power, the Phantom Society has been able to identify Covenant Holders for a long time. Up next, we have Ichiro Onda, our late computer engineer. He held a Covenant, but had no summoning ability. So, it's kind of useless inside him, huh? Going off the security footage we just saw, his Covenant is currently being held by that man, Zenon. Zenon. Xenon Zenon. This means Iron Mask is in possession of at least two Covenants at this time. Yeah, he's got a head start on us, but we're gonna... We, we, it, it's, it's good to have a handicap. The third Covenant holder is a Devil Summoner, Mangetsu Kuzunoha. I imagine a certain someone here knows a lot more about him than I do, though. Ooh, so he's part of Ara's organization, you think? He's one of Yadagarasu's top Devil Summoners. And one of the key players in protecting this country. Yep, I knew it. I mean, it's, it's kind of obvious when you think about it. There you have it. The fourth is a man named Saizo, who operates out of Karakacho. He's a freelance summoner who's had dealings with both Yatagarasu and the Phantom Society. Well, if only he knew the danger he was in by working with the Phantom Society. And lastly, our fifth covenant holder was me. Though that's clearly not the case anymore. No, it was not. That's the one I currently have. So many of them have switched owners in such a short time. It's kind of hard to follow. Kinda. <laughs> That's the understatement of the century. Hang on a sec. Does that mean Iron Mask was targeting those two Covenant holders at once? If that's true, then the others could be in danger too. Milady, any idea where Saizo might be? Where it is, he's typically hanging around Bar Hydran about this time. It's over on Jinsando Street. Well, I guess we know where we're going next. Then that's where we gotta go. You coming, Fig? I'll wait here for everyone. If worse comes to worst, we can't allow our enemies to obtain any more covenants. See, Fig? Fig is intelligent. She knows exactly what not to do. <laughs> that said, You'll need an operator of sorts to appraise the situation. So allow me to play that role from the back end. Ah, so she's gonna be like our, um... Oh, what's her name in Persona? I can't remember. I know she's like the hacker. The, that support character. Roger. We'll let you handle things here then. Just don't let any strangers in. And Milady has officially joined the party. Alright. You can now navigate to Shinsando City from the map. The safe house is the team's base of operations. If you select rest from the menu, the party will fully recover HP and MP. 
Also, certain DLC items can be collected at the safe house. Select DLC from the menu to claim any items you've downloaded. However, keep in mind that attempting to receive any items at your maximum limit will result in, you take, will result in the extra items being discarded. Ah, so... Make sure you have room, otherwise you lose them. I mean, I did get the Deluxe Edition, so there is going to be some DLC. Phantom Suit for Ringo, Pirate Armor for Arrow, Red Latex for Milady, and Princely Attire for Saizo. That kind of spoils that Saizo's going to join our party. I guess I could have just ignored it. The Persona 5 Alternative Set. So I can now... Oh wow, it actually, it actually boosts stats as well. Let me see. Where is it? Where is the Phantom Mask? I thought he'd be wearing it or something. Outfit. Not bad. Oh, nice. <laughs> wow, he is, he, he's very convincing. I have to admit, he looks very, very... But he looks the part. Whoa. Not bad. <laughs> uh, look at that. She's Panther. Wow. <laughs> System booting. Of course, she's going to be Phantom. <laughs> I love the hair. The dark outer layer and the inner glowing layer just looks uh oh, looks it looks amazing. Let's go team. Alright, I guess first things first is let's give her a mystique. Now, time for some punishment. Yeah, you can have the electric one, the Zeo. Alright, let's uh let's rest. <laughs> Gotta remember to do that. Can you believe we spent the first 40 minutes of this stream just in uh dialogue? <laughs> oh cool, my lady's at level 5 too. Does that mean when a new party member joins they'll be at the same level as your team? Or at least the lowest level party member at anyway. Alright, let's go. Shinsando, that was where we were going, right? A city with a touch of glamour, and home to unique shops like Zafiro and Bar Hydrant. People from all walks of life gather here. Oh, right, and it actually shows us who has the Covenants as well. So does that mean that the Covenant owners are going to change as well? A bit more than they are now? Wow, the city is alive, isn't it? Wait, the bar's out in the middle of the... In the what? <laughs> oh man, I didn't realize that the bar was just out in the open. I would not the be surprised. The bar is Hydrin. I wouldn't be surprised if people would hit on Ringo. Hope this size will guys in today. Well, there's only one way to find out. Shinsando is a trendy commercial hotspot full of Vogue boutiques and classy cafes. You can buy accessories at Zafiro or visit Bar Hydrant, a local nightlife favorite where all kinds of people and rumors can be found. Ah, so maybe for side quests. Look at all these people you can talk to. So we can actually... I wonder how many demons there actually are going to be. Huh? Saizo? Of course I know Saizo! The high fashion brand Saizo, right? The designer there. 
Huh? That's not what you're talking about? Wow, maybe Saizo does own Saizo Corp. I wonder what Maki's doing. Huh? You're looking for someone? Sorry, I wouldn't know. It's kind of interesting how, you know, NPCs have come a long way. I remember back in the Super Nintendo. Well, at least I remember, like, um, Breath of Fire. I know in that one, a lot of the NPCs have the same dialogue. What's up? But nowadays, every every character that has dialogue has their own unique one. It's amazing how far we've come in such a short... Oh, I guess... I guess 25 years or so isn't exactly a short amount of time. 30 years. But, you know. I guess in technology, it is old. Oh, you're cute. What is it? Have you fallen for me? Wow, okay. I knew they'd get... I knew she'd get hit on. Huh? Saizo? Who's that? I don't get it. We're outside now, so I'm gonna put my hat back on. Huh? Saizo? Never heard of him. Is he famous or something? So, you're, you seem to be one of the few who doesn't know about him. If you're looking for someone, you might have better luck asking one of the shopkeepers instead of the people passing by. I guess that's true. Sorry? Saizo? Ever heard of him, Hero? Huh? Who's that? Wow, no one seems to know who he is. Welcome. Well, isn't he a suave looking man? Ah, there's a new face in town. Name's Hughes. I own the place. Nice to meet you, Hughes. Hughes, huh? I'll remember that. What can I get you? Never hurts to start with something easy like a white ale or the like. I just noticed how small Ringo seems to be compared to everyone else. <laughs> oh, Ringo, you're kind of cute. You're small and adorable. Sorry, but we're actually looking for someone. His name's Saizo. You haven't seen him, have you? Saizo? He was here not too long ago, but I think he left for work. Aw oh, man, can you believe we just missed him? Just gonna have a quick drink. Refreshing. You might catch him over in Karakacho. That's where he runs his day to day. Okay. We'll need to hurry. Yeah, we don't know if the Phantom Society could get to him first. Thanks for the wreck. I'll save it for next time. Yep, we'll be back. Don't you worry. We'll be back many times. You can now navigate to Karakucho from the city map. But I think we'll go check out the shop first. Zafiro, huh? Looks like an accessories boutique. Uh-huh. Oh, a customer? I'm Mannequin. Might as well save you the breath. First-timers always beg to know my name. <laughs> well, it's only polite to know your name, right? Especially if we plan to be regulars, which we probably will be. But I can hardly blame them. I mean, look at me. Uh... You need to tone that down a bit. Uh, sure. <laughs> I knew Ringo wouldn't appreciate that. Well, browse at your leisure. It's only humans who want the finest glamour money can buy. And you have that, huh? But don't take it too hard when you realize you'll never reach my level. Oh my god, this guy's so full of himself. Oh god, I'm gorgeous. Vanity is a sin, you know. This guy can't get enough of himself. Can he even see us? Does he even know he's running a shop? It's almost impressive. But don't let him know that. What? No, impossible, inconceivable. Whoa, uh, what's <laughs> you okay? That was a, a sudden reaction there. I see now. You're not human, are you? <gasps> How did he know? Why do you say that? 
Well, there certainly can't be a human more beautiful than me in this world. Oh, you big flattery, you. <laughs> oh, uh, thanks? <laughs> oh man, I love Ringo. She is just a delight. I won't settle for second best. Why are you why are you why are you making this a competition, huh? Let me know if you need help. At Zephira, you can buy accessories for Ringo and the party. Accessories can enhance your defenses drastically, so don't forget to equip them. You can equip purchased accessories in the summoner menu. As you progress in the store, you'll f you'll find you'll find the store will get new items and stocks. So check back every now and then. You gotta get with the trends. A trendy shot like this needs to have the latest fashions, after all. Now, what can we buy for you? Engineer boots, calculator watch, silk bandana. Wait, why is the silk bandana the better defensive item? And the cheapest. You wanna buy that? Thanks. You want You're in for it now. Alright. Uh. So oh, there you go. It just doesn't affect armor defense, it can affect other stuff as well. So yeah, if you wanna I guess we'll have to try and get everything. So do I want her to be... I mean, technically Melody does seem to be a strong lady. Maybe Engineer Boots you would work. Buy that? For her. You... Just to be safe. We'll, we'll stick with that for now. Here? Wow, what a jerk. Come on. We're, let's, let's get out of here. I don't even want to talk to you now. See ya. We're out of here. So, to Karakucho, right? Let's go. can appreciate them auto-saving just before important battles rather than get you like soft-locked Karakucho oh look there's a Jack Frost or oh, it looks like a Dark Frost is that what the evil Jack Frost is Dark Frost it'd be nice to know <laughs> If anyone does know that, I'd love to I'd love you to get in touch with me about that. <laughs> Let's go. Over here. Wait up, Melody. Where are you guys going? You do realize I have control of your devils, right? Karakucho is a haven of indulgence and commercialism. Here you'll find Club Cretaceous, where summoners can find private jobs, and Della Mancha, a superstore chock full of items. So this is where the general store is for items and such. And looks like there's a, uh, a request board somewhere in here as well. Like a guild. Club Cretaceous in particular will be a vital resource since that's where you can find requests seeking the help of Devil Summoners. You can earn a number of rewards by completing them, so it's recommended to balance your progression in the story with handling some requests now and then. I mean, sure, I guess. I think that's the general store. We don't need to go there yet. Wow, invisible walls. I didn't think that'd be something huh? in this. What, you want to mourn more about Joannis? Oh, not him? Saizo? I don't know who that is. Does no one here know who Saizo is? Well, you see... Right as I say it. Saizo? Sure, I know him. That quick-witted detective, right? Where is he? Hmm, sorry, I wouldn't know. Well, at least you know who he is. Whoa, he just went right through me. Excuse me. Good evening. 
You're not the first person I've seen rushing around wild eye tonight. What's the deal? Some local restaurant got an all-you-can-eat deal that's about to expire. Uh, no, I, uh, those are my friends. Uh, sorry about that. Hmm? I'm sorry, who are you? Saizo? Nah, I never heard of him. Uh, I'd love to get some sushi right now. I say that despite not really liking fish. Huh? Saizo? I don't know about a Saizo, but we do have a Taizo over at our club. Uh, no, that's not quite what I'm looking for, I'm afraid. Eh? So, a random back alley, huh? I had a feeling that's where they'd be. Let's have a quick look in uh, Cretaceous first, though. So this is what they call a club. Wow, this is a... Uh, very extravagant. Well, from the looks of you, I take it you live on our side of the world. What do you mean by that exactly? Huh? Sorry for surprising you, stranger. The pleasure's all mine. I'm Ginko, Madam Ginko, to some of our summoner regulars. Uh, hello there, Miss Madam Ginko. Nice to meet you, Madam Ginko. I'm Ringo, but I'm not exactly a summoner. What do you mean, your side of the world? Well, you can summon. So technically you are. Kind of. Here at Club Cretaceous, we provide certain specialty services to the people of this city. Such as evolving and stuff. More specifically, we put clients in contact with summoners for private contracts. Oh, this is the guild. Okay. Really now? Sounds like this place is good for more than the nightlife. So if I drop by, I can hear about some local problems that need a summoner's skills? That's what you're saying? She's sharp, all right. That's our Ringo. Yes, that's correct. Okay. Why tell me about this? Sounds like you want me in on these jobs. Got something you want me to do? I wonder what we have to do. Do we have to, like, collect stuff? Go into dungeons and find items and people and stuff, maybe? I'm sure I will soon enough. I guess not right now, because we're in the middle of a story event and all that. Saving the world is certainly a noble cause. But there are times when you must narrow your scope and hear the small voices. Fair enough. All I'd ask is that you help the people who need it. That's the true calling of a devil summoner, after all. <laughs> yep. Sounds fun. Might help me get the information I need, too. Yep. It's a, uh, it's a two-way street. You help me, and I can help you. Please, come in. Clients in need of summoner's help can send requests to Club Cretaceous, the domain of Madame Ginko. Here you may accept requests and hear Madame Ginko's briefings before setting off. Clients will have icons above them indicating the current status of their request. Keep track of these to get a quick sense of your move, your next move. Oh, look at that little Jack Frost. Jack Frost is cute. So we already got a new job. What's that? Merch search. Allow me to explain. Perhaps you've seen the store De La Mancha on this street. Our client for this request works there. A girl named Yume. Even I've shopped there on occasion. We've talked enough that I know something of her troubles. To tell the truth. A short while ago, she lost something of a great importance to her. It's left her in clear distress. I did some inquiring myself, and after some investigation, I can say with confidence that a demon is responsible for this. I ask that you handle this as well. Consider this request placed on my behalf as well as on hers. I'd be grateful if you could help. Ideal level six. I humbly ask this of you. My thanks. I suggest you head to Della Mancha and get the details directly from her. And what about Lady on the Mind? As to this request. The client for that request works at a host club in Caracucho. Weren't we just there? I think we were just there. Typically, civilians don't get to have any involvement in our business, but it does happen every now and then. It would seem this client is caught up in a rather peculiar fate, and is therefore unsure of how to proceed. Your task this time around is to simply find someone. Very basic, yes, 
but it's an ideal warm-up nonetheless. Sure. I humbly ask this of you. Best of luck. Your client should be waiting for you in Karakucho. Do you have any other business with me? Let's have a talk oh. with her. You looking for Saizo? No, I've not seen him today. Though thinking back, I did sense a powerful aura of spiritual power nearby. It's possible he could be involved somehow. Please, come again. Alright. Oh. Are you serious? Hey, you're the one Madam Ginkgo sent? I'm your client, Teruya. Wow, so the rumors were true. What luck. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking for a girl. She came to our club about a month ago. <laughs> she was so beautiful. I'm telling you, it was love at first sight. We're talking the real deal here. <sighs> but she hasn't come by since. If I don't get this love letter to her, then it's nothing more than a scrap of paper. Please. You've got to find her and give her this letter for me. All right. Any details? Let me think. Well, I know her name's Chris, and I've heard she works near the shopping district. At least I think she does. Well, it'd be nice if you actually did know. No. I'm actually not all too sure what her job is. Salmon runner or summer runner or something like that. Those are two very different jobs, sir. That's going to make things even harder. Alright, let's go. I mean, there are a load of women to talk to around here. Alright, this is that's the other quest we have to do, but we're gonna... Right. Where would... Do I even need to go again? I'm glad we have this. Alright, lady on the mine. Yeah, he's looking for a woman by the name of Chris. Sounds like this Chris works near the shipping district. Shipping district? I don't even know if there is a shipping district around here. Righty ho. Is this where we needed to go? <laughs> ah, the shipping district. Oh, Jack Frost. Hello. Hello. You there, summoner. I'm Frost Ichiro, the eldest of the Jack Frost brothers. Ho! Wouldn't you know, ho it? I got some dehemons I need you to take care of. Ho! Pretty please? You wouldn't abandon a snowman in need, would you, ho? Well, it's, it's level four, then I think we're more than su we're more than capable of doing this. Let's go. You really mean it? Thanks a lot, ho. My brothers and I are looking for a new he home, somewhere we can live in peace, ho. I don't like it that he keeps saying ho. <laughs> that sounds awful. I'm thinking that see he side warehouse ought to do it, nice and quiet, ho. Yeehaw. But there's just one problem. My little bro, Foss Jiro, is allergic to spiders. He can't e he he even get close to them, ho. And with all the Suchigoma nearby, little bro could never live he here. No ho way. Yeah. Please, summoner, help us get rid of these pesky Suchigomos, ho. This place will prob probably be a lot safer if you defeat five or so, ho. It's all you, ho. Okay, no problem. Some requests require you to defeat demons roaming dungeons. These enemies will be marked on the icon shown above. This will make it easier to track down and eliminate your targets. Well, that's a very useful thing to get. Thank you. Right, so... Guess we just gotta run until we find something. No, you don't! Alright, and now we're into the stream. We go into our first battle. No, it's actually our second one, actually. <laughs> I forgot about that first one we did. I'll get this Good hit. It was funny because with with two of us it was it was easy. Still with me? Ooh. Nice to go with that. All you, 
So I guess all, I guess these furries are all weak to certain out, to, to all the key elements. Let's go all out attack. <laughs> there we go. No problem. Right, so my lady obviously doesn't have the same amount of XP already, so she's going to be a little bit weaker. Oh, here she is. Hmm. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm Chris. Are you a summoner too? <gasps> oh, so she was a summoner. Ah. Host club? Yeah, I went once. I got invited by a friend. It was more or less just a bunch of pointless chit chat though. Thought it was kind of boring. Oof. That poor guy. Huh? Terrier? A love letter? Oh, you mean that loudmouth kid? Hey! Wait, you really came all this way just to deliver this? I see. Well, sorry to waste your time, but I can't accept it. Mind passing on a little message for me instead? I mean, I kind of figured that would be the case, to be honest. You just met her once and, you know, she wasn't really all that happy to be there, so of course. <laughs> poor, poor man. I feel sorry for him. F's in chat if anyone's there. My apologies. Tell him he's playing with fire. Get involved and he'll only get burned. Alright, so that's soul sorted out, so that's a quest we can turn in. Whoa! Oh, god damn it! Where did these come from? Uh, maybe it's because you guys are so weak. Nice move. Okay. Good idea. You got it. I mean, I'm hoping there's somewhere where I can like, like in Persona, where you can like enhance and upgrade your uh, your your devils. That works. Or you know, Personas in that case. Too late for regrets now. Russia! He's so nerve. Easy, G -G, easy. Fix is about to level up as well. Hey! Battling demons increased chance of joining you. This demon's captivated by how cute we are. Looking this cute's gotta be a crime. That's so funny. I've never seen anyone fight like you guys. I kinda dig it, can I join up? Uh, okay. Blah. Oh, you've got one of my besties with you. Yeah, then I think she's got it covered. Oh right, we can't actually get more than one of the same type of devil. I mean, I guess that makes sense. It's not really Pokemon, is it? <laughs> On your knees. Or I guess on your face. <laughs> oh, that's... Oh, I didn't realize that would happen. That's... Yeah, let's just... Uh... Yeah, get in that bonus attack on. We can really only like level up them up now. They won't learn any more skills, unfortunately. They've already maxed those out. That's why I'm hoping there'll be a place where we can upgrade our devils. Great, right? This demon says they want to join us. You're so awesome, miss. Ah. <laughs> uh, am I only gonna get these deep devils to join us? No, I don't want to fight you. You can go away. I don't think I can go anywhere else around here anyway. Anyway, that one's by a uh, teleporter, so that should be fine. Uh, I guess Twitch or YouTube, it doesn't really get much, doesn't really get me much traction. On your face. This won't take long. 
At least these things have different weaknesses and resistances. Here goes. You know what to do. Got it. It's all you. Let's go for a regular attack. This is over. Oh, it resists physical attacks. Well, the more you know. Okay, any more? We need to we need to kill four more, don't we? I was kind of hoping at some point we'd actually get the, uh, we'd get a spider to join us. Keep it up, Ringo. I'm not your baby. That'll work. Dance. I know, right? I am. Nice. <laughs> We only need Pixie for this. You wanted a fight? You got one. Yeah, it's pretty. Oh. Come on, let's get this spider. So we can at least focus our attacks. Looks like it'll. Give hell, Ringo. Accessing stress. So nervous. Yeah, we got this, man. Nice move. With an extra party Let's member, go. this area is just just easy pickings. Easy win. Indeed. <sighs> it's kind of boring, isn't it? How easy this is. This. I found this garbage on the floor. I'm gonna burn it. <laughs> huh? I can't burn this because you want it. You're pretty weird. Okay. I mean, I can't help it. <laughs> I can't help that it's an item that I could use. Alright, any more for any more. Huh. Oh, damn it! Ah, oh, I lost. I missed a chance. Here I come. At, least, at least we're getting crits. Let's stay cautious. We're lacking intel on this one. Huh? You think fire would work against a spider, but apparently it's not. Okay. What now? Let's go. Good idea. We can target their weakness. Now, Eric. Right, at least we can target their weakness. Will it be able to take them down for us? I think that's mission accomplished, right? <coughs> Excuse me. I guess we just gotta keep taking them down just so we know for sure. Weapons, yeah. Good plan. Accessing data. Weakness found. Go ahead, Ringo. I mean, this is the only issue with not having a chat any chat members. A game like this with so much downtime. It's kind of this can, can be kind of difficult for Easy a uh, a beginner like myself to uh, keep the conversations flowing. You defeated the Suchigumu as requested. You should report fr back to Frost Ichiro, but there was another Frost nearby, so I want to talk to that one first. Uh, not here, at least. I mean, oh, oh, I can't believe I missed that. Ooh, a devil. The demon says they want to join us. You're so awesome, miss. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, you remind me of my wife when she was younger. I suppose I could go with you, but... <laughs> Excuse me, what? Eh? What? Oh, my God. Let's see. Can you spare a thousand yen? Yeah. 
Well, aren't you sweet? You're even as generous as my old sweetheart. I like you, Missy. And Suchigomo, the Jirai. Might be a little rusty, but I'll show you I still got it. Yeah, new demon. Yeah. So he's already level four. He can use poison. Weak ruin damage to one enemy, high chance of inflicting poison. I mean, being a spider, I sort of figured poison would be its specialty. Weak gunfire damage. He can't wield a gun. <laughs> Silly game. Anyway, let's 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 give arrow. Jirai. I'm just wondering where that Jack Frost would be. Yeah. Go away, I don't want to fight you. Yeah. Go away! Oh, hello! I did it! See that? I found what you were looking for, didn't I? Shaman's Mark times two. Ooh, it's times two. Aren't you proud of me for remembering? I'm gonna go see what else I can find lying around. Alright, thank you. <laughs> On your knees. Peon. I was gonna say, wait, did I go back? See, I see it over there. Whoa, I almost got I almost got caught there. Looks like I'm gonna need to go to a teleporter to get to him. Ah! Where the hell have you come from? Don't sneak up on me like that. That's not very nice. Ah. All right, let's let's just go and teleport. Whoa! Oh, hello. Hey! Hey, miss. I found a human earlier, so I killed them and took this. <gasps> Why would you do that? Why did you kill them? <laughs> Just kidding. I picked it up over there. Really? Mm. I don't think I believe you. Bye -bye. Ah, whatever. It's money for when I uh, summoned uh, Jira, the spider. You defeated five Suchigumu already? Amazing! Or amazing! Oh, thank you, ho! <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Don't call Ringo a ho! How dare you! Don't you say that about her! Don't make me angry! A new he home. Not even my little he bro has a place to call home. He's gonna love it, ho. I guess there's no point in getting mad at him. That's just the way he speaks. It's like it's like it's like someone with Tourette's. They they can't help what they say. So you know. You gotta forgive him sometimes. Right, let's go back to uh Karakucho. We got a few quests to turn in. Ooh, ooh, uh, very tired. I just can't get a good night's sleep when we go on to the early shift. I just can't. I just can't adjust my internal clock. It's so frustrating. Huh? She didn't read my letter? Give up? But why? <laughs> 
Wow, she's too cool, man. Seriously, what a woman. Uh, of course he's not gonna give up. That'd be way too easy. I guess I'm not good enough for her as I am. But I won't let it get me down. Someday I'll become a number one host and win her over. It's not what you think, my dude. It's not what you think. She's trying to protect you from yourself. <laughs> Wait for me, Chris. Oh, right. Here's your reward. Ooh, money. Thank you. Right, let's go turn that last request. Please come in. Oh wait, I, I haven't actually done it yet. Luck. We need to go to the shop. Tax free shop. All right, let's go welcome, do this. Welcome, welcome. Those in search of cheap prices, look no further. Gala Mancha is here to please. Oh my God, she's freaking adorable. Oh my god, I love her! Her design's amazing! I, I, you know... I love the hat! I think she has good fashion sense, don't you think? I mean, I love her, I love the hat. The hat just screams fashion. Hello there. Well, aren't you polite? My name is Yume. Right, so she is our client. If you have any questions, Feel free to ask me. You may so freaking cute. What do you sell here? Anything and everything. It's what sets our store apart from just about everywhere else. I mean, the building looked really big, but this interior looks kind of small. It's not just me, is it? I know it's a little noisy in here, but by all means, take a look around. She's so nice as well. Welcome! So anyway, we came here to talk. Oh, can I help you, miss? Huh? Miss Ginko sent you? Oh, gee, she didn't have to do all that just for me. Still, I'd be glad for the help. Can't make an omelette without breaking some eggs, I guess. Actually... The truth is, I lost some Frost Diver superhero merch near the shipping district. I should have gone, I should have come here before I went to the shipping district. Of course everywhere would want me to go to the shipping district. Huh? Whoa, you don't know what Frost Diver is? No way! It's this awesome live action superhero show. It's huge, as every Saturday morning. Uh, nope. No, can't, can't say that I know, but I'm afraid. See, he's this ancient warrior frozen in ice 20,000 years ago. Except global warming thawed him out, and now he's a hero of justice secretly protecting Earth? Oh, so he's some sort of cla Captain Planet sort of deal. He's Frost Diver, the Glacial Guardian! Uh, I mean, just so we're clear, it's my little brother's into it, not me. Aw, oh, it's fine. You can be into whatever you want, you know? It's okay. You can be into whatever you want. Your secret's safe with me, Yume. Um... Um, anyway, so I... Well, my brother, he was playing around with the superhero merch, pretending to be Frost Diver. But one second it was there, and the next it was gone. I think someone might have stolen it. There's nothing left for us! Uh, isn't that a little bit dramatic voice line right there? <laughs> But it doesn't make sense. The East Shipping District is off limits and nobody else was around. Ugh, I don't get it. Still, I shouldn't be unloading all this on a customer. It's not like it'll change anything. Well, actually, I think you'll find it'll change everything. Thank you! I'll come back and shop after I've collected your super merch. Auto mapping controls, huh? Leaving this to you. Head out! All right, let's go. We'll probably see the spider fella. Wait, what's this mean? Recycle. Hee Summoner, I was he hoping I'd see you again. Turns out after you beat those Suchigumo, a bunch more shit hold up. It's like they never left, ho. 
Please, ho, you gotta help us clear the Suchigoma again, ho. Take out just five more and I'm sure they'll be gone for good. At least I he hope. Okay. Okay, I'll do it again. I mean, you know, he is a bit rude, but it's fine. I can, I can forgive him. Let's go teleport to the, uh, where the actual spiders are. I'd rather make my way from there rather than start all the way from the start. <laughs> On your knees. I'll leave this to you. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't matter what I use, it's all regular damage anyway. You know what to do. Right. Get lost. <laughs> What's our next move? Let's go. Oh, right. I put a different character on, didn't I? Wow, I poisoned a spider. When afflicted with poison, you'll lose HP after taking an action. Poison may go away after a number of turns, but it can be treated more quickly with healing items or I with healing skills or items. I mean, I didn't actually get poisoned, but whatever you say. Oh, he's able to resist the needle shot. Now, here we go. Time for some punishment. Yeah. Oh, I should really give. I should really give someone nice his. Uh, finish this. Get lost. I should give someone his um What's his deep opener? devil. Okay. Uh, done. You wanted a fight? You got one. All right. Let's let's put your demon on a on melody. It was poltergeist, wasn't it? Ice, ice magic, and all that. Now I'm wondering where the uh, item could be. What do you think it would be in the boss area? Give him hell, Ringo. Big damage. Well done, Ringo. With this power. Eat this. Oh, I wondered if that might be resistant. Well, let's hear you. Here I come. I guess not. How about that works? How freeze your soul. Too late for so, yeah, we're not gonna head. take everyone out, but we'll take most of them out. I mean, with two devils, we should be able to do enough damage to finish them. Nice. I can't believe it. I didn't think we'd take them all out. I guess it just goes to show how strong we are. Also, Jiray didn't really, uh, doesn't really have many uh, good of skills against the enemies around here. Yeah. Let's go, I wonder why I only sometimes get the ally ambush anyway. I'll leave this to you. Good idea. Accessing data. Weakness. Go for it, Ringo. Oh. Yeah. Hit them in the weak spot for massive not damage. Bad, Ringo. Let's finish That's this. Not. Best to go with that. Is that it? Oh my god, these guys are wimps. I, I mean, I guess we did get day. the ally attack. Alright, we're going into the boss area first just to see if that's where the item is. I guess not, huh? So where could it be? Mind you, the Jirai are only ever here, so I just need to take one more down and then we can uh, have a good search. I'll follow your lead. Yeah, that'll work. Go for it, Ringo. Got it. <laughs> I'll follow your lead. That'll work. Yeah, of course it will work. Nice work. 
you like that, Ooh, that best to go don't back give me the orders. There is literally wow, nothing to worry about around here. There you go. I need to report back. But let's have a bit of a search, though. Because we need to find this uh, figurine for the Yume. I can't let Yume down. We're like kindred hat spirits. Oh, look at this. I need to break from play. I mean, from walking around. You gonna take a break too, miss? Well, we got the HP healed. But not the MP, which is something we're beginning to run low on now. I literally just want to knock him down and run like hell because I don't really want to fight anymore. Yeah! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Go away. What does he have for us? Ah. In some requests, speaking to specific people or demons will launch you into battle. Such individuals will be marked by the icon shown above. Make sure you're ready for a fight before you confront them. I think we're ready. Oh, hello, hello, chromosome. Uh, the male one to be specific. The demon's holding something. It looks like the superhero merch that you may lost. Huh? Who are you? You got a problem with me? Look, I'm in a bad mood right now. Like, really super bad. I tried to copy that lady. I did the poses. I yelled the transformation words. Said it was morphing time. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, I know it's not completely accurate, but it's like, no. Alright, I'll call you Chromo. Nice to meet you, Chromo. But nothing happened. I look the same. What should you do? Take back the merch. What? That lady a friend of yours? That does it. I'm going to kick your butt. With with those spindly legs? I don't think so. No, 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 no. Can't afford to lose. Fine. I'll get serious. Hope this works. It's the it first out. time I've met these. Here goes. You know the drill. They're spitting fire, right. so I guess boof. Could be risky. Think this Let's through. Play it cool. Yeah, I thought so. We'll take them down. Okay. Is that really your plan? Work. I think we got this. Yeah, this is the main reason I wasn't responding to your uh, message messages, uh, Chromo. I hope you can forgive me for that. Ow! Fire hot! Wow, you really gonna you really gonna bully him, huh? No matter what, might work. No more games. Why don't you die already? Fine, I guess. Love to see it. Guess you are switching to offense. It's all right. This will take him out. Out of my way. Okay, that's fair enough. Charge! It's nice you to have someone in here to talk to. It really gets quite lonely. Oh, even demons you don't have in your party also gain experience too. Ah. You got the superhero merch. You should return this to you, May. I must return it to my kindred hat spirit. Out of my way. Don't want to fight you. I'm way too strong for this place. Report this quest and I'm think I'm done with this place this area.
Excuse me. Oh, this is a great camera angle. <laughs> you defeated five Suchiguma already? Amazing! Ho, oh, thank you, ho! Lord is water. Now even my little Hebro has a place to call home. He's gonna love it, ho! Seriously, I don't like that he keeps saying ho. It's not a nice word. Uh, there you go. Right, so any you can accept again are like permanent, I take it. Please, take your time! Here she is, let's go and give her back her superhero. Oh! Um, miss, is that what I think it is? There you go, it's all yours, Yume, baby. <laughs> That's amazing! Wow, you- Wow, I can't believe you actually found it! Are you a goddess? Really, I can't thank you enough. I was running out of excuses to keep my brother away from it, too. Actually... I've actually got five younger brothers. I first started working part-time here to help out with the family finances. Oh my god, she's an angel herself. Of course, anyone with a hat that fine is always going to be an angel. So we don't get a lot of time to spend together as a family. Except, well, when Frost Diver comes on. That's fine. I saved up a ton to get the superhero merch, so it would have really broken my heart to tell them it got stolen. Thanks so much! For helping me, miss. You've saved the day for our whole family. Yay! I'm so happy. New items are in stock. <laughs> oh, wow. I'll well, of course. Your while. And I'm always glad to see you around the store, of course. I'll always give you the best deals. Thank you. Mr. Sizer, the detective? Oh yeah, I know him. He's a regular here. S see, at least some people know who he is. That reminds me. I feel like I saw someone dressed sort of like him pass by the shop not too long ago. Really? Let's buy. Portable first aid kit and chakra syrup. This is all very expensive. Revives one ally with a small amount of HP. Will this do it for you? Thanks a bunch! Well, I never know when I'll need that, so it's always good to have one. Guarantees escape from battle. So I already have five of those. Store 100 HP to all Will allies. This do it for you? Thanks a bunch! Yeah, I'll take one. Why not? Is there anything else? Okay, let's go. Oh man, a pizza place. Wait. A robot pizza chef? What the heck? Look at this place, it's fancy. I guess this is a future with high-tech chefs and stuff. All right, let's let's continue the story. Were we too late? <sighs> Why are we always a day late and a dollar short? Too late? Again? I can't believe it. We're always too late. Not the cleanest way to go out. So, where does that leave us? I mean, to be fair, it looks like he put up a fight at least. Are we already at a dead end? Not much choice. All we can do is soul hack him. Pretty much. It's our it's a one-stop ace in the hole. Which not even our enemies seem to know about. Is that really an option? Fig's not going to be happy. I mean, when needs must and all that. 
Hey, you said it yourself. Sometimes we've just got to follow our instincts. Of course we do. Someone was after Saizo's Covenant, and we need to find out who. Our whole mission's riding on this lead, and I'm not just going to sit back and lose it. I guess we're going to get another party member already. I think there's only one more party member after, after Saizo, so... Or maybe he is the last party member, I'm not entirely sure. No time to waste. I'm gonna give it a shot, so watch my back. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Alright. This is the first time my Twitch streamers are gonna have seen a soul hack. Systems are go. She's, 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 uh, she's defenseless when she does a soul hack, so it's always good to have some backup. So he was fighting a, a devil. there. Are you still in one piece, miss? Oh my god, he was protecting someone! Thank you. <sighs> Oof. Wow, that seemed to hurt. I wonder what that was about. That's the first time I've seen her get hurt watching a memory. That didn't happen with Arrow or Melody. <laughs> He's one of those people, huh? Ooh, tough one. Would you believe I've got a burning ambition to be a comedian someday? <laughs> uh, uh, you, you're not serious, are you? Oh, okay, maybe he was. Now I feel bad. Oh my god! Taken out by his friend? I'm sorry, eh? Saizo. I'm so sorry. Wait, you killed him? But why? Annie? Wow, betrayed by someone he thought was his friend. Ouch, that's gotta hurt. Did she kill him? I just wish I could have told you. I wanted us to start over. Oh. Well, you'll get that second chance. Saizo, right? I'm here for you. <laughs> yep, yeah, I'm here to. For, I'm here to drag you from the to cold embrace of death. Never thought the Grim Reaper would be this cute. <laughs> well, aren't he really is a smooth one-liner, isn't he? He's a smooth talking one-liner. I'm not a Reaper man. Not even that grim. Actually, I'm the opposite. I am an angel. Come to save you. My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. I'm trying to stop the end of the world. I came here to bring you back. Yep. You're gonna live a bit more. So you're telling me this smooth-talking sweetheart who's out to save the whole world set some time aside just for little old me? You're important. You got it. What do you think, Saizo? Your story doesn't really end here, right? You've got some unfinished business. Oh yeah, he does. Damn right I do. I never got a chance to talk to her. You, you, you never... Uh, weren't you talking to her, or, or are you talking to someone else? I'll never have a real ending until I fix that. 
Okay. Okay, then I'll give you that second chance. Take my hand, Saizo. You're gonna wanna take it. <laughs> Why not? I summon demons for a living anyway. I can handle a deal with the Grim Reaper. <laughs> well, if you can if you insist with the Grim Reaper, then sure. I said I'm not the Grim Reaper. <laughs> oh, <laughs> she she doesn't look too happy about that. Welcome back. And this is the first time my lady's seen this happen, so I'm not surprised she's so su surprised. Huh. It actually worked. Go figure. I'm not the only one who kind of finds shark teeth kind of cool, am I? There are some really, you know, even, even, you know. Oh, what was, what was it? Uh, there's a manga where the MC, uh, you know, the main love interest has shark teeth, and I, uh... Uh, Hitomi-chan is shy with strangers, I think it is. I think, I believe she has shark teeth. I think. If I'm remembering correctly, I might not be. I still need to buy the latest volume of that manga. No way! You know, I've been a summoner for a while now, but I gotta say, Feeling a little out of my depth here. Yeah, it's like you were summoned, isn't it? Like you're a demon summon. This is something totally different from summoning. It's the power of Ion. And Ion would be your boss, huh? Well, none of my business. Well, he catches on quick, doesn't he? Glad I don't have to over-explain anything. Hey, I focus on the bright side. I'm here and I'm alive. That's enough for me. I mean, that's fair enough. I think we'd all I think we'd all like to focus on the positive. I see Melody and uh mm, sorry, I'm drawing a blank. Tarot or something. <laughs> so she, so he knows Milady. It's Arrow. Isn't that just the weirdest name? I I'm pretty sure it's a code name, but still. If that was his actually name, hello, my name's Arrow. Arrow sounds like a pet name. I don't know. It's just that's what I think it. You'd probably call your pet your dog Arrow or something. Aren't you both summoners for Phantom? What's the deal with killing me and then bringing me back to life? Ah, uh, yes, about that. I mean, let's be real. I'm not worth that much trouble. So you say. But I think you could be very useful. Well, it's complicated. <laughs> That's the easy way out of a explanation. A spy and a traitor, huh? I see. Sounds like you guys got a lot on your plates. That we do. For now, just consider us independents. We're not aligned with any one organization. Yeah, we're we're sort of like shadow agents. Gotcha. Probably more convenient that way for me, too. At least I think Shadow Agents is the right term. Sorry to get straight to business. Was your covenant taken by a guy in a mask? He was there, yeah. But he wasn't the one who took it. That'd be his freaky bodyguard. Yep, these two are gonna be a real pain in our butts, aren't they? Zenin, huh? Don't know much about this covenant stuff, but I take it that's what you guys are chasing? Yep. Among other things. I'd say it's fair to assume Iron Mask now bears three covenants. Can you believe it? We're barely like a few hours into the game and the enemies already have half the covenants. That is a bad sign right there. So you guys already know it was the Phantom Society that wiped me out, huh? They're the only ones we know who are after covenants, so it's the uh, logical conclusion. Well, we were kind of hoping to get to you before you got killed. Yeah, we're always a bit late. My bad, I guess. 
came out of nowhere. Yeah, and that guy's really powerful as well, Xenon. He is going to be a difficult boss fight, I'm sure of that. Look, forget that. Any of you see a summoner lady around? Gorgeous? Got one of those always tired faces? Looks great in black? There is something about a tired-faced woman. I don't mind that. I, I kind of dig it. I mean, I've always got a tired face. I saw a girl in that soul hat right before he died. Is that who he's talking about? That could be the only person he could be talking about. Sorry, but we didn't see anyone else around. Unfortunately. I hope they didn't kidnap her or anything. Ugh. Those bastards used Ash to get to me. They knew what they were doing. Do you think that means that Ash is actually a member of the Phantom Society? Oh man. Well, if you're after the Phantom Society, how about coming with us? The more the merrier, as they say. I'm in. And there we go, that's our fourth party member. No hesitation, huh? I owe Phantom a little payback, you see. So I'll tag along, at least until I can cash that check. I mean, he's straight to business. I like that about him. Sounds good to me. You guys all right with that? Sure. We need all the help we can get. And Arrow knows the si knows the deets. No objections here either. All right, then it's decided. I mean, at least they'll get along with him, unlike each other. Uh, we should probably head back to the safe house. Review what we know. Yeah, that's probably good. Huh? Oh, Ringo. Yeah, she was. Uh, she seemed to be taking damage with that soul hack. Maybe she can only use it a certain amount of times. Whoa. You okay? What's going on? Fig, can you take a look? You've done too many soul hacks, I'm afraid. You can't do any more. Tracing. Mental abnormality detected. I'm seeing an unknown disruption of your brainwaves. Ringo, did you soul hack again? <laughs> you can't pull the wool over Fig's eyes. Uh, yeah, sorry. Go on. Get the complaining... Out of the way. Uh, I think you're gonna pass out before that. Hey, wake up! Ringo! Yeah, that was definitely gonna happen. She's been using that soul hack so recklessly. Hey, uh, what's the plan here? Do we take her to a hospital? No, we go to the safe house. We don't want that many eyes on us. Let's get her back to the safe house. I mean, she's built different, so... Fig might be able to treat her better than any hospital would. Hey, Fig. <sighs> Fig? Ringo is awake, everyone. <laughs> what? Huh? Oh, 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 okay, I'm awake. I'm awake. Just about. <laughs> oh, yeah. I got all dizzy and passed out. Yeah, we're about to learn something about the soul hack and its drawbacks. Yes. And then we immediately brought you back here. Sheesh. It really freaked me out back there. I guess even Ion can go weak in the knees, huh? <laughs> oh, come on. Enough of that. I didn't think you'd be able to pass out either, actually. So you had me worried, too. Are you alright now? See what you did, Ringo. You made everyone worry about you. I don't think a server of Ion should be doing that. But that's just me. <laughs> Sorry about that. Looks like I gave you all a good scare. Damn straight. I'm guessing since I have a physical body right now, it's only natural that I'd feel unwell once in a while. Yeah, you shouldn't use your energy too recklessly. Ringo, Flamma wants to talk to you about what happened. She might know something more. Mm-hmm. Flamma wants you to meet her at the Axis. She said to bring the other summoners with you. Wow, we're taking them all with us? What? Taking everyone to the Axis? Is that really going to be okay? 
I mean, they are on, they are they are on the ride. Under normal circumstances, I think not. But considering the urgency, it might be a necessary evil. Yes, we need to go now. Got it. Then I guess that's where we're headed. Hold on. She also said that everyone should be prepared to fight. Eh? What? Wait, what? What? Why? Huh? The heck? What's that about? What, are we gonna fight in the Axis or something? Th that's what it sounds like. Really? I don't know myself. Flamma? The Axis? You're gonna get to go meet Ion, potentially. Or going to where Ion is. Sounds like we'll just have to go see for ourselves. You're probably right. Well, time for a little trip, gang. Look, that's fine. Are you sure you're up for it? I mean, whether she's up for it or not, I don't think so, uh, is the question. Yep, couldn't be better. Hate to be a pest, but if there's gonna be a fight, mind if we stop by Monse Realm first? I was hoping it would give us a chance to save, because I think it would be a good place to stop. I got a few things I gotta take care of. He's got a point. It'll be a good place to prepare, especially knowing we're going into a dicey situation. It's gonna be an interesting point to continue from, that's for sure. I'm sorry, Ringo, but I must ask you to go on without me. I have matters of my own to attend to. Okay... Yeah, sure thing. Alright, we'll all meet up at Monse Realm. With Sizer joining the party, it's the perfect place to stop. Well, I guess we should rest first. So I don't have to worry about doing that later. I'd hate to forget. Well. Well, that was, that was, that was much better. That was better than when I stream on YouTube. So, I guess with that said, guys, thank you very much for watching. It's been fun. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya! Bye!